because it is an organization that deals with water conservation, we derived our name from the water molecule H2O. So the water cycle and the life cycle are one. So we put we in water because we need water more than water needs us. Water is the only resource in this environment that we seem to think that it is plenty, but it is not there. So most of us are helplessly wasting water, throwing away bottles, not thinking about the environment, and water is a very important resource. And if we keep wasting it, it will not be there. We don't want to reach to that point where we will find we don't have water to drink. So why don't we think about that moment when you will turn on your tap and you won't find water running. We don't want to get to that stage. So it's better, to, it's better safe than sorry. So uh, the earlier we do this, the better. I think it's a good time to sensitize people and I think it will ring in their minds that they have to conserve water. This is the rainy season, so by next year, maybe during this time, we're hoping we'll have converted the plastic bottles into gutters. And then after we've done that, we give out these gutters for free and we look for people who can install them so that people can harvest rain water. And then we, we have this simple method of creating water harvesters and how you can convert rain water into clean water and safe water for drinking. A gutter installation, it's mainly applied in the rural areas where you find on the rooftops there are some, they look like gutters which actually have a connection to a tank or somewhere where it fetches that water. When you're in the shower, when you're bathing, um, yes, there's the running water, but you can turn off the tap while you soap up. So you save that water, you turn off the tap, you soap up, then you turn on the tap and rinse yourself. People in the rural areas actually know this, because when it's raining, you, you find people running for their buckets and their basins and they take them outside, they fetch that water and they use it. So even in the urban areas where you find the population is rising and yet their demand for water is also rising, don't shy away from taking your bucket outside to just trap that rain water. Ukiyoshi is of Yombo, don't use running water because that wastes like a lot of water. So you, you save that water like uzioshe in one round. Usishinde like unangoja. Like for example, unangoja mtu amalize kutumia kikombe, you wash it, mtu mingina, tumia another plate, you wash it. That wastes a lot of water. So first thing, ngoja vyombozote zikuwa then you wash them at once, then avoid using running water.